Hello everyone, we are back with Glen Velvet Reviews today, and I got this crimping tool kit, uh, self-adjustable from, uh, I got this off Amazon, that's what the box looks like, if you guys want to give a pause and see if you know anything on there, there's kind of the label, and that's it. So let's open this up, I don't remember how much it was, I mean obviously you know me, I'm a bargain shopper, so it wasn't like, I was like, let me get something expensive. If I was in the commercial atmosphere and I was a, an electrician that I made a lot, you know, that was my living and I made a lot of money off of it. Not that I just work for someone, but if I made a lot of money off of it, then I would, you know, invest in, you know, awesome tools because it's just a write off at that point anyway. So, and it's great to have really nice, good tools, but I don't have that luxury anymore. My business is gone. So here I am. So, um, this opens up like this pretty much opens up. Here we go. This is the crimper itself. Okay, I don't know how to use anything, but uh, I never had one like this. This is the first time I ever had one like this. I usually have this one. Like I told you, you're going to laugh. I know that this one's the bootleg one. These are the, this is the one that I get, the one they have at Home Depot that comes with the kit. I bought about maybe six of these kits in, I don't know, maybe, what, 20 years of my life. Of Well, I mean, you know, maybe 18 years of working. Uh, 18 years in the field, I guess you could say. Um, I bought uh, like six of these and let me tell you I probably crimped a thousand wires with the six of these so I mean there's nothing really wrong with these uh, the only thing is after a while if you're doing um, like you know more stainless steel clamps for high temperature if you're doing stronger metals this starts to wear and bend and then when you go to crimp the space opens up here and then it doesn't crimp that well anymore yeah you could try to fix it if you put uh, you know you could fix it with a pair of pliers but when you try to bend the metal back, it's not the same strength anymore. Uh, so I find it's not it's not worth it for, I think these are what, like 10 to 15 bucks. comes And it comes with a bunch of these to use it. So you really can't go wrong. So that's kind of how it opened. I just pulled it. It went like that. So I guess it has different sizes in there like that. Um, I do not know what this is for. It says adjustable. So we do not know what that is for. And there's no instructions on what to use that for. But there are different notches. But I guarantee you this is going to work for what I need. Let's open this up. Now we are going to give a test. And, you know, because I got to crimp a wire onto my uh, central vacuum. If you saw my videos, I'm working on a central vacuum, doing a project. So this is kind of uh, what's up. That's what the size is or what you can expect it to have in the box. And oh, it comes a little, obviously they all have that. I mean, I saw that on my dad's in like 1985, I'm mean, well, 1990, 1990, I saw this on my dad's. So, I mean, that's not really a big surprise to see that. Uh, so here's what's up. I mean, it comes with a bunch of these. I'm probably going to end up just using, uh, you know, these red ones or something like that. So they are going to go in there. And I, yeah, see, this is pretty cool because it's made to crimp uh, both sides at the same time, uh, see? So see how this crimper is, you would have to do, if you're crimping using anything, you would have to do one side and then the other, so you would have to do this side and then do this side if you're crimping with this. I, I mean, I didn't, like I said, I didn't care. If when you're biting down on this, make sure you put the seam on, you know, the seam on one of the sides of the metal here and then the seam kind of seals into the wires and really gets good grip um so that's kind of what's up so i am going to use these i am going to use this but this might not matter because it does have the sides so maybe when it squeezes it uh it actually won't even matter uh, which side you put it on i'm not sure i haven't used this you know in the field or anything like that so see this is for my central vacuum um so let me strip this and look for my wire stripper so we're gonna strip uh one of these right here and hopefully this i know this is a really tiny wire i get it don't you know whatever but this is like a good test i guess because this goddamn wire is so small so so hopefully i am going to use the the cord i'm about to crimp on because i with this you have to put in both wires at the same time it's so most likely i'm going to use these two wires right here and hopefully that'll work so let's go on now my only worry is these wires are really tiny so since i do not have a lot of meat on this wire hopefully you can see that since i don't have a lot of meat on that wire i'm gonna uh make this longer and then fold it see so i'm gonna do something like that so that way mine's gonna have uh, more meat on it this has i want this to go in as deep as possible okay pretty sure we got them both in really tight there's a lot of wire inside there, which is good. Let's see how this thing crimps. 
I'm guessing you just line it up in the middle. Okay, ready? Squeeze. I only see an X and an I. I don't know. They don't even tell you anywhere what this is for. I mean, you pr you're going to tell me in the comments because if you use this all the time, you know. But I just bought mine, so I have no idea. All right, feels pretty strong. There it is. So I made it. There's a small wire. So I'm going to do the same thing, and i got to run this wire out. It's going to be really cool little setup that I got going on here. All right, so that's it for Glen Velvet Reviews. I'll be testing this out and seeing if it works. If you have any questions or comments, please post them down below. I would love to know. Also, subscribe to my channel. Join me on my review adventures as I try to put up stuff to help out the community, just like I get help from the community. All right, everybody enjoy. Be safe. I'm out. Bye-bye.